Hi, welcome to the Bing Ads video. In this video, I'll show you how to create effective Bing Ads campaigns. How to write effective ads. This is the usual format. First would be the headline of the ad, followed by the first line in the body, which usually describes the product or a problem. The second line to give the incentives or to add in a call to action. First step is to use dynamic keyword in your ad. To insert a dynamic keyword in your ad, simply use the following tag shown here. It works by showing the search keyword in Bing search in your ad, as long as the keyword is in your keyword list. I'll show you in a second how to use this tag in your ad copy. The second step is to add keywords in your ad, in your ad copy, which includes the headline, body, and the URL of your ad. Third is to create and test multiple ads. At least have a minimum of three ads for each campaign. Next, to qualify your customers. It is not hard to get a lot of clicks, but it is hard to get a lot of clicks from qualified people that will become your customers. So you need to qualify your customers by adding either a price tag or decisive detail on your ad copy. And finally, include a call to action in your ad copy, just like the line 2 above. Examples are shown on the screen, such as get estimation now, buy now, or sign up today. Let's jump to Google and search for Bing Ads Intelligence and download the tool. Bing Ads Intelligence is a free tool that works like Google Keyword Planner for Bing Ads. The tool provides precise keyword research data and planning for Bing Ads marketers. We highly suggest using this tool instead of Google's tool for keyword research purpose on your Bing campaigns. Scroll down and click the download button. Run the setup file. Click install. This will take a few minutes and the tool will integrate with your Microsoft Excel document. After installation completes, open the Microsoft Excel. As you can see, Bing Ads uh, Intelligence is being uploaded into your Microsoft Excel. You notice a new tab added in Excel called Bing Ads Intelligence. Click on the particular tab. And first sign in to your Bing Ads account. Choose the Microsoft account link. And sign in using your email address and password for your Bing Ad Center account. Select yes. Select your account name and load it up this is the Bing Ads intelligence guide on how to get started using this tool to research keywords for a new campaign click keyword suggestion and click on customize add a base keyword for example, hosting. You may select number of keywords to be searched. Bing Intelligence will produce reports of past data on keywords Bing had received searches for. Example, base keyword hosting generated website host, which has an exact type and had the many searches and all the ads received this many impressions and clicks. The CTR and CPCs of this particular keyword followed by how much in total advertisers spend on this particular keyword is shown as well. We can sort out the CPC of any field here from smallest to largest or largest to smallest. You can find keywords that are performing well with high CTRs or getting the most traffic and average CPCs. This will give you a good idea on keywords being searched on Bing and bid by other advertisers. And you can use these keywords in your campaigns 
effectively. To further the keyword research, select on the keyword column and you may search traffic and select the start and end date. Select the view type to open in a new worksheet. Here you can sort the searches from highest to lowest and you'll be able to see the most popular keywords and the amount of searches during the selected period. Back to the main sheet, same process but with different research criteria. We change the device to view keywords performance from mobile. You can change the search type, add position, Use this data to determine the best keywords for your campaign and each column can be sorted from largest to smallest or smallest to largest. This is the real and reliable data from Bing and not an estimate from any third party tool. Other research criteria can be found under more research area here. Let's try the age group and gender. Back to the main sheet and select the age group and gender as you can see each keyword have their age groups and genders defined in percentage for this keyword it is searched mostly by people in 50 to 64 years old in your campaign for this keyword target the following age group Highlight them to see them easier. So for these three particular keywords, these are the age groups targeted. Same goes for the genders as well. All this data can be saved the normal way of saving an Excel file and can be edited or refreshed for latest data. Clicking the refresh all button. So you know what is working the best at the current time. Use these keywords, device, age and gender data in your campaigns to get the best results. Next, let's go back to Bing Ad Center account to create a new campaign. And add a campaign name. Add a campaign budget. This account is in my local currency. So I'll put in 20 ringgit, which is equivalent to 5 USD. Language, I'll keep it as English and I'll be adding some targeted countries. First one will be the United States. I'll add in Canada as well. And the UK. Select people in your targeted location so that Bing will only show your ads to the people located in the countries above. Let's create a text ad. In the title, add the tag called keyword to simulate our search keyword. As we have covered earlier in this video, there's a dynamic keyword in the ad by using the keyword tag. Next to the ad text body. The first line focuses on the problem or requirement. And followed by a call to action. Adding the display and also the actual destination URL.
for keywords we can copy from the Bing intelligence document uh, select the top keywords with the most clicks click add usually all keywords are set to type broad you should add uh, exact and face type the bid price will be changing later click the save button enter a custom search network bid Targeting options and advanced settings will be changed later as well. Click save. And we are done. So, campaigns are safely created. Next, go to settings and select a campaign. Here we can edit demographics by increasing or decreasing the bid percentage. For gender and as well as age. You can follow this based on the ad intelligence report. And target these particular age groups. Click save. Next, head over to keywords and fix the keyword bid price. These are the current bids that are going on for the keywords. Select everything and click on edit and click on change current bits and put in a bit that is default for all the keywords below. Save. Let the campaign run for three to four days with minimum of five dollars per day budget so you can collect enough data for Bing to optimize the campaign. Click on dimensions after the campaign runs for more than 24 hours to review your results and thank you for watching this video.